And so here we are. This moment in time, this moment in God's plan for each of you and for you together, all those preparations, all that last minute detail, it's all done and it's time. It's time to say those important words that will launch you into life's greatest adventure. I know you remember well the first time you met and it didn't take too long, I'm sure, before you liked each other. And it didn't take much longer after that, from what I understand, that that like uh, grew into love. Are you excited? It's so excited. And so I walked up to Kara and I was like, Kara, there's guy A and there's Chris. What do you think? And so she's like, well, what about that Chris guy? You were athletic, tall, you didn't like wearing shoes. I never met a person who didn't like you and you had just cut off your long hair don't care, as you so called it. <laughs> Those were just a few of the reasons I was drawn to you at first. So I went up to Chris and I said, Chris, I, I think you should start talking to Kara. I think you should take her on a date. And three years later, here we are. You know, think of love as a seed. It's got to be planted in good soil. It's got to be planted in tender hearts. It has to be watered with things like words of affection, things like deeds of kindness. And in the right environment, that seed of love, it'll put down really deep roots. It'll produce a beautiful plant and it'll bear fruit, joy, and peace, and grace. Carrie, you're athletic, smart, beautiful, fun, adventurous, confident, and you love the Lord seriously. What more could I ask for? Absolutely amazing. <laughs> you ready? start off by saying simply, I love you. You mean so much to me, <laughs> and I've been blessed to know you these last three years. I take you to be my husband, my constant companion, and my best friend. I will forever be there to laugh with you, inspire you, and unconditionally respect you through all of our adventures in life together. You encourage me when I'm down, build me up when I'm weak, you tickle me when I'm angry, and you challenge me to be a better person and pursue my dreams. I love you with my whole heart, and I can't wait to share forever with you. You're the perfect girl for me, and I'm so excited to spend the rest of my life loving you. I declare that they are husband and wife in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. You may kiss your bride. It's so exciting to be gathered here as, as friends and family and to celebrate such an enormous day for Chris and Kara. Kara and Chris are incredible and there are so many things that I see in them that I have learned from them. Know that God is already with you and in you guys. And with that, there's nothing you can't withstand. I thought I saw it all, but I was staring at the wall. Yeah, I thought I 
We love you both, and uh, we look forward to seeing how God is going to work in both your guys' lives in the future. To Chris and Kara. moments were shared with Chris and Kara and as much as both of you have played individual roles in my life you've definitely played an equally as big of a role as a couple. Thank you so much for giving me such a beautiful relationship and now marriage to have as an example. I love you both so much. Chris and Kara. I was falling apart when you took me by the hand, you know you really took a hold of my heart.